Hey guys, um, today I want to talk just about weather instruments with y'all. Um, you have a paper that you were given uh, when you did your packet pickup that has a good um, illustration of the instruments we're going to talk about. So first we have an anemometer. Anemometers can look uh, different ways, but anemometer measures wind speed, how fast the wind is blowing, not direction, the speed of the wind, okay? Next we have one you're most familiar with, I'm sure, I'm not holding this very good, there we go, a thermometer. Uh, that's measuring your temperature, how much heat there is. So um, those can look lots of different ways, but that's just measuring what the temperature is. You have Fahrenheit and Celsius. Here in the United States, we use Fahrenheit. Uh, if you travel around, you might see that they uh, measure in Celsius. Freezing is 32 degrees Fahrenheit for us. Okay, next, hygrometer. I remember that hygrometer begins with an H, and that's humidity. So it measures the humidity, how humid it is, the amount of water vapor that's in the air. Um, so when we're talking about it being humid, it's like you can feel the wetness in the air. All right, so a wind vane, uh, sometimes you hear it called a weather vane, shows what direction the wind is going. So we have one just like that here in our courtyard, um, but it's not gonna tell you how fast it is, but it's gonna point in the direction of the wind like a compass. Okay, next, barometer. Instrument I think is very cool. It measures pressure. There are high and low pressure systems all the time and we're gonna learn about how that really, really affects our weather. So a barometer is very important because depending on what kind of systems you have out there depends on the weather you're gonna have. And then last, a rain gauge an instrument used to measure rain. Um, there are lots of varieties of this. We have some here at school. You may have uh, one at home. We're going to make one, or I'm gonna give you the directions on how to make one, and hopefully we can measure some rain while we're at home. So those are some basic instruments that we use to measure weather. <laughs> 